नारायणम नमस्कृत नरम चरोम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तत्व उदीर नष्ट प्रायशु अभद्रेशु नृत्यम भगवत सेवया भगवती उत्तम श्लोके भक्ति जीवित न अर्हत क्लिष्ट जीवित न अर्हत क्लिष्ट विप्र धर्म अच्युत आश्रया विप्र धर्म अच्युत आश्रया संस्थिते अतिरथे पांडव संस्थिते अतिरथे पांडव प्रूथा बाल प्रजा वधु प्रूथा बाल प्रजा वधु युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु सर्व काल कृत मे सर्व काल कृत मे भवता चत अप्रिय चत अप्रिय स पाल ये लोक स पाल ये लोक वायो इव घन आवली वायो इव घन आवली अहो कष्ट अहो अन्याय अहो कष्ट अहो अन्याय यूयम धर्मनंदना यूयम धर्मनंदना जीवित न अर्हत क्लिष्ट जीवित न अर्हत क्लिष्ट विप्र धर्म अच्युत आश्रया विप्र धर्म अच्युत आश्रया संस्थित अतिरथे पांडव संस्थित अतिरथे पांडव प्रूथा बाल प्रजा वधु प्रूथा बाल प्रजा वधु युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु सर्व काल कृत मे सर्व काल कृत मे भवता चत अप्रिय भवता चत अप्रिय स पाल ये लोक स पाल ये लोक वायो इव घन आवली वायो इव घन आवली अहो कष्ट अहो अन्या यूयम धर्मनंदना जीवित न अर्हत क्लिष्ट विप्र धर्म अच्युत आश्रया संस्थित अतिरथे पांडव वृथा बाल प्रजा वधु युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु सर्व काल कृत मे भवता चत अप्रिय स पाल ये लोक वायो इव घनावली अहो कष्ट अहो अन्याय यूयम धर्मनंदना जीवित नरत क्लिष्ट विप्र धर्म युत अच्युत आश्रया संस्थित अतिरथे पांडव रूथा बाल प्रजा वधु युष्मत कृते बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु सर्वकाल कृत मे भवता चत अप्रिय स पाल ये लोको लोक वायो इव घनावली आशीष प्रभु जी प्लीज रीड अहो कष्ट अहो अन्याय युयम धर्मनंदना जीवित नर नरहत क्लिष्ट विप्र धर्म अच्युत संस्थित तीर्थे पांडव पृथ बाला प्रजा वधु युष्मा कृते बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्त कपती मुहु सर्व कला काल कृत मे 
भवताम च यद अप्रियाम सपलो यद वसे लोको वायर ईव गनावली प्रजावधु धर्मनंद जीवित न अर्हदीष्ट विप्रधर्म अच्युत आश्रय संस्थित पांडव वृत बाल प्रजावधु युष्मे बहुन क्लेश प्राप्त दोह वहीमु सर्व काल मे भवता चिप्रिय सबलो ये लोको वायो इव धर्म अच्युत आश्रया संस्थित अतिरथे पांडव प्रथा बाल प्रजा वधु युष्मे बहुन क्लेशान प्राप्ता तोकवती मुहु सर्व काल कृत मे भवता सपालो यद वशे लोको वायुर इव घन आवली ही। हरे कृष्ण ट्रांसलेशन एंड परपट बाय द श्रीला प्रभुपाद जगत गुरु श्रीला प्रभुपाद की जय भीष्मेव से टेरिबल सफरिंग एंड वॉट टेरिबल इनजस्टिस यू गुड सोल्स suffer for being the sons of religion personified you did not deserve to remain alive under those tribulation yet you were protected by the brahmanas god and religions as far as my daughter in lakunti is concerned upon the great general pandu's death she became a widow with many children and therefore she suffered greatly and when you were grown up she suffered a great deal also because of your actions in my opinion this is all due to inevitable time under whose control everyone in every planet is carried just as the clouds are carried by the wind a parpad by the shrila prabhu jagat guru shrila prabhu pad ki jay maharaj yudhishthir was disturbed due to the great mass cry in the battle of kurukshetra bishma dev could understand this and therefore He spoke first of the terrible sufferings of Maharaj Yudhishthir. He was put into difficulty by injustice only, and the battle of Kurukshetra was fought just to counteract this injustice. Therefore, he should not regret the great mass acre. Uh, he wanted to point out particularly that they were always protected by the Brahmana, the Lord, and religious principle. As long as they were protected by these three important items. There was no cause of disappointment. Thus, Bhishma Deva encouraged Maharaj Yudhishthir to dissipate his de 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 despondency as long as the person is fully in cooperation with the wishes of the Lord, guided by the bona fide Brahmanas and Vaishnavas, and strictly following religious principle. One has no cause for despondency. However, trying the circumstances of life. Bishma Deva, as one of the authorities in the line, wanted to impress this point upon the devotees. The sufferings of Kunti Devi upon the Pandavas. The suffering of uh, Kunti Devi are doubly lamented. She suffered greatly because of early widowhood, and to get her minor children uh, brought up in the royal family, when 
and when her children were grown up she continued to suffer because of her son's action so her suffering continued this means that she was destined to suffer by providence and this one has to tolerate without being disturbed uh, there is control by time all over the space within the universe as there is control by time all over the planets all the big gigantic planets including the sun are being controlled by the force of air as the clouds are carried by the force of air similarly the inevitable call or time control even the action of the air and other elements everything therefore is controlled by the supreme call a forceful representative of the lord within the material world thus dhishtir should not be sorry for the inconceivable action of time everyone has to bear the actions of and reactions of time as long as one is within the conditions of the material world yudhishthir should not think that he had committed sins in his previous birth and is suffering the consequence even the most pious has to suffer the condition of material nature but a pious man is faithful to the lord for he is guided by the bona uh, fide brahmana and vaishnava following the religious principles uh, these are three guiding principle should be the aim of life one should not be disturbed by the tricks of eternal time even the great controller of the universe brahma ji is also under the control of that time therefore one should not bruise uh, being thus controlled by time despite being a true follower of religious principles om agyana timirandasya gyananjana shalakaya chakshurun militam en tasmay sri गुरवे नम श्री चैतन्य मनोभीष्ट स्थापित भूतले स्वयं रूप कदा मह्यम ददा स्वदाक वंदे अहम श्री गुरो श्रीयुत पद कमल श्री गुरून वैष्णवांच श्री रूपम सागर जात स गण रघुनाथान्वित तम सजीव साइत सवधूत परिजन सहित कृष्ण चैतन्य दैव श्री राधा कृष्ण पदा स गण ललिता श्री विशाखान्वितांच नम ओं विष्णु पदा कृष्ण प्रेष्टा भूतले श्रीमते भक्ति वेदात स्वामी नीति नामिने नमस्ते सरस्वते देवे गौरवाणी प्रचारिणे निर्विशेष शून्यवादी पाश्चात देश तारिणे वाचाकूपे च कृपा सिंधु पति पावणेभ्यो वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नमः जय श्री कृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभु निनंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर श्रीवासादी गौर भक्त वृंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा कृष्ण कृष्णा हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा कृष्ण कृष्णा हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 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 कृष्णा वी ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड श्लोका नंबर इलेवन ट्वेल्व एंड थर्टीन here they are describing uh, about the bishma uh, uh, dev describing about the how the uh, see, uh, how the condition of the kunti devi uh, from uh, childhood from uh, up to her uh, sons grown up also and uh, what uh, what then uh, uh, they can do that uh, and how is uh, the yudhishthir maharaj is doing after that and uh, giving the instruction to them before uh, describing the glorification of the kunti maharani or uh, 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 by the bishma deva prabhu ji will tell in detail hare krishna hare krishna thank you very much mata ji so a very important part is starting the whole chapter 
is basically about how Bhishma Dev is going to be able to be dispel the agony, the grievance, and the feeling of being an offender of Yudhishthir Maharaj. Bhishma Dev, though he was lying on the bed created by the arrows in so much of pain, he could understand what is in the heart of Yudhishthir Maharaj and why everyone has come there. Because he was one of the devotees. And Krishna is there always with everyone. So he could immediately understand that Yudhishthir Maharaj was feeling agony. He was feeling that he is responsible for the massacre of so many people, so many living beings, not only humans. And so it was necessary that he should be able to dispel his such a painstaking situation. So what Dev is doing is immediately he is first trying to inform Yudhishthir Maharaj that whatever he did was not right. Whatever he did was appropriate and justified. And just see how he is doing. He is immediately telling that oh Yudhishthir in fact, terrible sufferings you have had to face. You have had to face terrible injustices. You are good souls. But still, you have been suffering. Do you are the sons of religion personified? Ideally, if so much of tribulations, so much of sufferings come to anyone, anyone would simply leave the body. It will not continue. So, ideally, you should not have been remaining alive. But still you are alive. And that is because of the protection by the Brahmanas, the Krishna and religion himself. So Prashmadev, he is initially talking about the sufferings of Yudhishthira Maharaj. And we are knowing all those things. Right from his childhood, when he had to take birth in a forest, when he had to leave, when he, the shelter of his father was taken away at an untimely moment, when he went back to the royal palace, but then suffered injustice as he was not easily accepted. How all the Pandu brothers, Pandavas, they were always given secondary treatment how efforts were made to kill his brother Bhima. And though he was the rightful heir to the throne, he was not given it. He was cheated one way or the other. He was sent to forest again. He was asked to be incognito for a year. And then when he rightfully returned to claim what was his, he was again denied. He wanted to be satisfied with just five villages. But the person denied to give even the tip of the small needle. So injustice is galore. And hence, because of the difficulties which are, he was put into by this injustice, the battle of Kurukshetra had to be fought to counteract this injustice. And again, this battle was not something which he desired. It was something which Krishna desired and that is why it, it became a Dharma Yuddha. So you should not regret the great massacre which has happened. It is as per the will of the Lord. In fact, he was so much troubled all over the years that he should not have been continuing itself. But he was always protected by Brahmanas, by religious principles and the Lord. So, if anyone undergoes any tribulations, it is only three things which can protect us. The Brahmanas, the Lord and the religious principles. And if these three are protecting, then there should be no cause of any kind of disappointment to anyone. 
and this is a fact that we should therefore not have any kind of a disturbance what is required that we should always be cooperating with the wishes of the lord we should be guided by a bona fide spiritual master a brahmana and vaishnava and we should always follow the religious principles so whatever trying circumstances we may come across in life we'll have no cause for disturbance so this is very very important and this is coming from bishma dev who is one of the highest authorities he is not only one of the vasus he is also the greatest of all so when he is trying to guide us on something it is very very important so practically what we learn from this shloka is that we should always take shelter of krishna we should serve krishna we should serve guru who is representative of krishna we should serve the devotees and we should serve the mission how is it possible by ensuring that we get at least five more persons to join bhagavatam class every day at 8 pm and at least 10 more persons each who join for the chanting session because when we are talking about being following uh, by of following strictly following religious principles the religious principles for kali yuga is hare naam hare naam hare naam yes. eva kevala priya is bolna so we should be following this and we should be doing all this under the guidance of a bona fide brahmana and a vaishnava so full surrenderance sarva dharman parityajya mam ekam sharanam raja is what krishna has said So we should surrender to the guru, listen to his instructions, and follow the three S: the sadhana, the seva, and the swadhyay. So sadhana is our chanting, sixteen rounds minimum. Sadhana is our following the four regulative principles. Seva is whatever seva we will get. Like right now, the seva can be that we should get more people to join the Bhagavatam class. more people to be encouraged to do chanting more book distribution to be there swadhyay ensuring that we become and learn all the scriptures appropriate that we are able to spread the message of krishna consciousness that will give us swadhyay so once we are able to do it even if there are very trying circumstances of life we have no pause for this point tense and what circumstances of life trying can be more trying than what kunti maharani has had to suffer the sufferings which she has had that doubly lamentable right from being early widowed right from her minor children not being under the shelter of their father somehow adjusting so that they can be brought up in the royal family and then seeing that even when they are grown up they are being ill treated injustice being carried out they being not getting what is rightfully theirs so her sufferings continue she also had to stay in forest so this is not normal sufferings so what it means is that it was providence which had destined her to suffer and what she is demonstrating is that we have to be tolerant without being disturbed disturbance will come but we have to be tolerant to it we should not allow our faith to be shaken up by any means because finally everything is under the control of the time and time is inevitable every planet is under its control so here bishwadev is giving the example how clouds get carried by the air similarly the planets are carried under the control of time time has control throughout the universe all over the planets big small sun moon everything and how through the force of air because it controls the action of air and 
other elements. So Supreme Kaal is controller of everything and that Supreme Kaal is the representation of Lord within the material world. So if something is happening because of that Kaala, Yudhishthir is not responsible for it. So he should not feel sorry. Every action has equal and opposite reaction. Everyone has to bear the actions and reactions of time if you are in the material world. So the massacre which had happened was a result of their own activities. Yudhishthir should not be thinking that he was committing a sin or he had committed sins in his previous birth and is suffering the consequences for that. The best of the persons, the best of the devotees, the most pious personnel, the moment we are in contact with the material world, we have to suffer the condition of material nature. A pious man can be faithful to the Lord if he is guided by bona fide Brahmanas and Vaishnavas. If you are following the religious principles. So, getting under a shelter of a Vaishnava, a bona fide Brahmana, very, very important. Surrendering to Lord, very, very important. And following the religious principles, the most important. So these three, they should be the guiding principles of the objective of our life. We should not be disturbed by the tricks of time. Even Brahmaji, who is the, what I say, the creator of the world, even he is under the control of time. We all know about the Brahma Vibhavan Lila. He wanted to Krishna, but then he himself got illusion. Because Krishna expanded himself in so many cows and coward boys. So we should not be having a grudge because we are being controlled by time. Though we are following the religious principles because everything has a plan which is of Krishna. It is the best plan for everyone. We just have to humbly surrender to Krishna, have faith in him, follow our three S, the sadhana, the seva and the swadhyaya. And then just see the miracle. Radharani will be pleased. She will give the recommendation to Krishna. Krishna will be pleased. And we will get the ultimate objective of our life. Which is Krishna. Prayer. So let us chant as much as possible. Let us read the Granthas as much as possible. Let us have this association as much as possible. Get more people into this association. Start doing deity worship at your residence. Take only Krishna Prasadam. Get engaged in some service like say book distribution or reading sessions or maybe supporting a center with Lakshmi and just see the miracle. Hare Krishna.